Chefs and Champagne is the James Beard Foundation's annual tasting party at Wolfer Estate Vineyard in the Hamptons, which this year honored James Beard Award-winning chef, restaurateur, cookbook author, and celebrity TV personality, Bobby Flay. Today I get a chance to talk to Bobby about the event and a quick chat with James Beard Foundation President, Susan Ungaro. For over 20 years, we've been celebrating the best of the best in the culinary world at our party in the Hamptons. Yes. And we've celebrated uh, culinary icons like Julia Child, Wolfgang Puck, Jacques Pepin, oh, wow. and Emeril. What? To everybody who loves food, good wine, and great champagne. Oh, that's us. <laughs> Cheers. Hello. <laughs> How are you? It's so good to see you. I've been great. I've been trying to hunt you down all day long. Bryce Schumann of Bettany. I'm here with Chef John Mooney, Bell Book and Candle. Make sure you check out Root and Bone, Jeff and Janine. They're making everything. It's absolutely delicious. I'm here at the 2014 Chefs and Champagne event at Wolfer Estate with the Bobby Flay, you're being honored tonight. Yes. How do you feel about that? I feel, um, I feel honored. Yeah. <laughs> frankly, it's a, it's a big deal. No, it, well, it's a really nice thing. You know, it's first of all we're on this beautiful vineyard, you know, Wolfer here in Bridgehampton, and um, I have a house in Amagansett, and so um, it's it's. Uh, it's, it's, it's a beautiful event, you know, great food from lots of chefs, uh, obviously really fantastic champagne from Tattinger. I wanted to talk to you briefly about your new restaurant in sure. the city, Gatto. Tell me what people can expect. Well, um, Gatto is my new restaurant. We opened in March. It's down in NoHo in Manhattan. And um, the food is Mediterranean, so we're, I'm pulling influences from uh, Spain and Greece and Italy and France and even like Morocco and Tunisia. So lots of Mediterranean cuisine. Um, it's a very flavorful, very healthy cuisine. People are eating a crazy amount of vegetables. You know, people what are eating is crazy going vegetables. They want to be healthy. I hear you guys have a lot of vegetarian dishes on well, the menu. Well, my number one entree is a, a vegetarian entree. It's a, it's a wild mushroom and kale paella. I would never have guessed that before I opened the restaurant. Right. And on our appetizers, the top four items are vegetarian. I mean, it's nuts. I, I can't wait to go. Yeah. I have yet to go. It's Please. all the rage. I want people to get to know you a little bit better, so I want to go off the cuff a little bit. If you were on Survivor, okay, and you were allowed one luxury item, what would it be? Caviar. I'll go caviar? Definitely. Caviar? I could survive on caviar. See, I was going to say chapstick, but caviar chapstick. is way more fancy. I need it. I need it. I don't even I need, need chapstick at, like, and, like, um, in, my, in my everyday life. So, no. <laughs> Caviar. It, would, it, would definitely, it would definitely be caviar for sure. Well, caviar is way more fancy. I well, don't... you said luxury, right? Luxury item. Okay. But no, for caviar. me, it's luxury. I don't want to hold you up. Congratulations on tonight. Bobby Flay, 2014 Chefs in Champagne, honoree. Thanks. Thanks, Bobby. Right, my pleasure. Thank you so much. It's chocolate ice cream. I'm excited to go and have a little glass of champagne. Me too. Gonna I'm going to meet you over there. Okay, you bet. I'm going to hold it to that. All right, guys.